Paper. So I tell you to send off and I get a notification when time I come on from the live. See? When I get no, no, no. Because I just come off a while ago and now I come back. It's like me have to wait long for so I come back on. But I understand still. When you talk to much truth and rights, you always, you know what I mean? So, it's okay. A while ago when I come off of the life, I get a DM. A girl said, um, she's been waiting on me to talk about the Jack Your situation. With Jack Your and the females, them, and she realized it's only certain people we talk about right and you know she got school and she do criminal criminal business criminal law uh, criminology or whatever she do seeing I understand her frustration and I want to get upset I'm not going to get upset. But sometimes when you don't hear me say certain things about certain people or certain situations, you don't have to remember that things were bad at me. And I decide to say, I just want to leave it alone and just watch mm -hmm. it play out to everybody. See? Me speaking of an individual. I'm in a business if I'm an artist, because me first come on and say, no found a favorite artist, them a rape and predator. Because a long time it's going in a music where enough man show them have a money, them feel like say them own a woman. See? This is what I always say. I'm not about no rape, I'm in a business if me and my friend, I'm not about no man where I batter no woman and I beat no woman. See? I'm not back nobody where I do them something. I'm not do it. That's why I always come on and tell females, say, know your worth. I always tell females, say, come on and, and, and know them worth. Because a man who use money and manipulate you. Always have your own. Make sure you have your get fixed money. Make sure if you're not comfortable in the situation, you leave. Zine, but no found no. I don't see when I do them live there. I don't just see me come on and talk about other things and I say, I don't hear. Better I don't say, I don't hear more than say, I don't attack me or blame me and pide finger and I say, oh, I specialize in this and specialize in that. We're living in Jamaica. You see the. the, 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 the where do I call it? The sugar daddy syndrome. Enough of these little young girls take it on because of what they see on the internet. So they take the disrespect and the manipulation from an older man or a person who has money because they want to wear these nice, what you call them? Um, what you call the ear them? The long ear them inches. See? They want to tell people that they don't wear synthetic ear. Nothing is wrong with synthetic ear as long as you don't wear it long. When I say long, keep it in for a long period. You understand? But most of these people are trying to keep up with the Joneses. When them and the Joneses not live same place, them live at Jonestown and them live at Jones Avenue and live at Jones Road. See? But them want to keep up with the Joneses while the Joneses them done up in one part already. That's why I may tell you no say. Before you come on and not expect say, it's like people and you know what I mean like? I mean like when time people come and tell me about members of my daughters. I mean like when people come on and tell me that. Because you have your family, me have my family. How you raise your family is your business. I no care, I no response. How me raise my family. I raise them because of my family. Me business about my family. Me can't 
business and worry about your family or your raise them. All I can do is sympathize when you know the fucker. I'm a son of a god prison when you know the fucker. Right? Me can't tell you how to raise you a child. All me can do is just say what me I say. I saw me influential, then if me say so much other things, you know, should I perfect? You know, should I perfect and just do the right things, then I reach you tell you, because I never tell you to do no fuck yet. Richie never tell you to do no fuck yet. I don't like when people come tell me about remember me have daughters and if I was my daughter. You don't have to remember this. The children them have a mind of them own. But you still have to give them room to do them own thing. Because you talk, you can talk as if they make up their mind to do something they're going to do it. See? Back to this raping thing and this manipulating thing and this abusing thing. I tell you this again. Females, I not responsive for Jack Cure. I not responsive for the the president of one rich country a man is going to treat you or you want him to treat you because if you are with someone and you are always treating them with respect and the first time they want to disrespect you and you allow them to disrespect you is your fault because you forgive them and you still allow them to do it again because remember, how you treat yourself, a man will treat you. No man now just get up out of the blues and talk about big pussy girl, hey girl, so good girl. Hey girl, I keep me for kicking in your face. No man now just get up and just come do that so. Because him see how you treat yourself, him see how you carry yourself. That's why it always pays to be independent. It always pays to be self-reliant. Somehow, no, licky licky. Beggy, beggy, suck everybody khaki, lick out everybody body. You know name they all about so you know love, you know freak, you know bow out, you know suck out and fuck out, you know willing for the tree so with everybody. Because you know just love fuck, you know just love do everything. So everybody does have one as a dog shit. Remember as a female, you can be a freak, but a freak to how many? You can do a little nastiness, a little freakiness, but to how many? How much people? You have to have a call up your name in a one circle. Because that most of these females who them name call up on certain things, them fuck everybody. Them and the, them and the, them and fuck the same entertainer them. Them love it and it's okay with them because them want to tell the one they say Skilly Ben can't fuck. She want to say okay, intense can't fuck. And she want to send it over pink wall and she want to send it over like she get a thrill out of saying she fuck 10 entertainer. And who could not fuck from over out small? And who come in a two minutes and who come in a 30 seconds. So again, I always tell you, is what you allow. I go continuously happen. The first disrespect should not happen in the first place. So you know, allow the first one to make the second one come. And it, what's up? See? So many times when you hear all a man like me at that, me not pick no side when it come on to abuse. I could have even my blood clad family. No, but I feel like some members say me have a daughter sometime. My member me have a daughter every time. Me remember that every time. Don't but I feel like some remember it when it's convenient to me. Me I always remember. Me I always think before me do many things. So I'm not try remember that something there. So I don't know talk about me for bring awareness. Who no need for bring awareness. I know the type of person where who no deal with. I know the type of person who want to look up to. I know the type of person who want to analyze and idolize and all of them something there. This is what me always are talking about. But when me and all them conversations, and the people them never want to do yet. I went time in, when them not here. I when them not here now, you know. I when them not here now because them never depend on life. They then me go get blamed. So me never say this. I said that. Me not blood clap business who you want to be. Me not response who you want to be. I must feel like I'm frightened for people and their money. Remember this. I'm going to tell you the next thing. 
I go and tell you the next thing. A lot of people have money. A lot of people is rich. A lot of people are wealthy. So there's a difference. Some people are okay financially, while some people are rich. And some people are wealthy. You understand? But there's one thing. You see prison? Everybody go in a prison. Prison is a place it not make for dog alone. It make for everybody. And money can save you from prison. I look at Mr. Bill Cosby, they are prison. I see R. Kelly, they are jail. I see Harvey Weinstein, they are jail. I see how much other people, they are jail. See? And they have money and they couldn't buy out everybody. See? So if somebody are going to say, oh, I chew them of money. No, because you have some people, you know. Them not going to go in a jail. Me understand that some people, but you say once you and the system no good, you fuck. Money does save you in Jamaica from O. When your name O. When your name O? Show gunners. Money save you when you are O. Think about what you say. Zane, a whole heap of people have money and are the lawyer alone benefit. I tell you that. And every time your money you can save you, you can do certain things. Certain things that can bring prison upon you, certain things that can bring death. That's why you hear them say the more money you get, the more problem. When you have a normal regular life and nobody don't know you, you can't live and survive. But once you become somebody who is famous, because you can be locally famous and you can be internationally famous, you know. You understand? A lot of people look on social media and say, what if people have, what if followers, five, six hundred thousand. But that's in Jamaica and, you know, a couple of Caribbean and some butch and some other people. When you are mainstream famous, it's wickeder than when you are locally famous. Main Street famous when you're mainstream famous in a man. Remember everything the blacks follow you. You can't have to take a shit in peace. You can't wear no clothes and it looks certain way. You can't even repeat your clothes when you're mainstream. So just always remember the law you alone win. Events and money can save you if you have good character. Nothing of them time here. But I'm not going to disagree with you. Good character and a work boy. Yeah. A last name work boy. Yeah. Saying. So, when me I say to you now, see, because I have a reason and then you don't know. More time I have too much things for reason about it, you get show off by some other things. Remember this now, you know, you have, you have so much situation where you go on, boy. Yeah. When I tell you, say, some of them parents are sending out them pit me out there too quick. The sugar daddy syndrome, remember, you know. Why do you eat around the whole place where everybody I say, yo, get a sugar daddy. I need somebody to take care of me. I just want somebody to take care of me. I just want somebody to take care of me. And I want this and I want that and I want that. And I, and I don't mind playing second fiddle. I don't mind playing a side chick. I don't mind doing this and I don't mind doing that. So enough of them get a man and then you have some of them come on and call them get finessed by a man. And the man finessed them and put them in an apartment. Let me tell you this, some of the young girl and some of the girl we have act like and go on like me are telling you this not no come easy in a life and no found to get some easy thing 
I want to say, yo, this easy man, look, let me not do nothing. Remember, say, come with a consequence. Now, for one of with the people, them, I don't want them, I don't just there for one who can get. Long time, no, I don't hear a woman say she want to build with a man. Long time, I don't hear some man say they want to build with a woman. These people are there, you know, don't get me wrong. Because remember, you have the test of time. The test of time, you might go through the test of time already with somebody and them not wall out. Them reach where they reach and them just say, fuck you. And you're hurt. So you feel away if you're not trying with nobody else because a lot of women are broken. And as soon as a man even mentions him, why the class assistant, you feel like, say, a deja vu this over again. See? And a lot of men feel the same way too. So it's like, we don't know how we are going to get over it. We don't know how we are going to get through it. But we have to just always remember so we have nothing but with self and we have no one but with self. If help comes along the way, we say thank you and respect it. Because you don't know we need the help. Because enough of we need help, of course, then we don't need help. Everybody need help. Everybody needs something. So you got us going in a relationship for what? For just fuck alone? Who want us fuck alone out of a relationship? Who want for us appear for everything all the day of them life? Who want just want to do that? You're a narcissist. That you just want to pay for something and then you sing and talk and dance about it every time you pay for something. Eh? So everybody needs somebody. Everybody needs something. But I always remember, say, you need yourself first, then you need somebody. You save yourself, preserve yourself, build yourself, strengthen yourself. Figure take on the world. You know what I mean? But when I try to say no, some of have a daughter as a meal ticket. Some of have a son as a meal ticket. I remember I talked to a girl. And the girl ever met me know so she talked to this guy. And each time she talked to this guy, video call. I call him sister, I call him auntie, I call him cousin, I call everybody. Just through this girl, they are foreign. And everybody has sent them blood clot size. Everybody has sent them size like you don't know if this girl had their blood clad for in a suck hood or a sell how much key a coke. Right? And uh, uh, Joe Biden and uh, this rascal uh, girl has um, father. So she have all of these Jesus in the world. You don't need to stop that fucking something there. Get to know the person where you have to deal with first before you try to send in your family. Right? No found to make it bad for real people who need real assistance. Come let me tell you, somebody will really want help not even go ask for it, you know. Somebody will really want help not even going to open their mouth and say nothing. I tell you no. See? You hear say the woman are a nurse. As you hear about nurse, you hear, oh, that means that they don't lose no work in the pandemic. Them they are work same way. Yo, John was start a girl, yo, thing I go on, you know, yo, me I got, yo, yo. Bigger a thing, you know. See? Someone who don't even give people an opportunity to give one something. One who don't even give a person the opportunity to offer. One who just ready for beg like one who don't no answer. Uno no band with no unlock up sound no band with it so. A sound no band with it. Sound no band with it. I wanna mash up enough thing. See? What may I tell you no? And all of us stay like that. And I know that there are a lot of independent girls out there who rather wear them ear till it's stiff up. Them rather wear the synthetic ear till it starts smell. And save and put up to and pluck up pluck and do whatever them want to just for reach because they don't want to beg nobody nothing. You know how much girl want to buy a new shoes right now and can't buy it because she have so much bills to deal with. She have so much things to deal with. She have so much what she want to go do. She can't even buy herself her shoes. And it's not like she not work. You know much girls like that. You know much girl we know. 
we are drive them car right now pan E. You think a E she want to drive it pan? Cause she have to think and I said, Jano start. I have that 2000 dollars but I have that for go pay. I mean, no, I need to care for drive car. I can't run out of gas. I should not tell a boy buy her little gas. But then you have some other girl with yam on the car. She did her work. Him not even ask her if she eat from blood clad. Man in. But him just know say I drive him girl nice car. She a pay a car loan. He might drive the car and the car they pay E. And he not look on it and say the car drive him. He just know say I drive it if it shut off, it shut off. You know what I mean? That's why I tell a man so I always have an open mind to everything. I know I live in a real world. It's not all that glitters is gold. Remember, we have to put our best foot forward. We can't look all and mash up. We have to put our best foot forward. You know what I mean? Most of these topics where you hear me touch on, you know, many people agree, you know, because they might live it, you know. They might not comment and say they are going through it, you know, but I understand. Because they don't know we have a thing called pride. We're very prideful. See, we're full of pride and we're pride. I go kill you, but you have some people. You see, a beggar don't have a conscience. A beggar do not have a conscience. A beggar don't business if it's Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, early in the morning, late in the night. A beggar don't business. They don't sympathize. I mean, I'm telling you this, people, man and woman, all of us are going through something. Don't be afraid or ashamed of your struggles that you're facing in life. Because this too shall pass. As long as you have faith with strength, I'm not even going to say hope, faith and strength. But them say, believe, kill and believe, cure. You wasn't going through all of this all of your life. So you're going through a time right now and a patch. Hold up your head. Don't hold your head aground. Put yourself together the same way. You're not try to please human beings. You're try to please yourself. A long time your ear not do now. A long time you're not buy a shoes, rude boy. A long time you're never buy a shirt. Because you have your youth, them where you have your look pan. You know what I mean? And you don't know you're responsible. So it's all about the youth, them. And nothing. You're looking at the house and your sister, yo. You don't know in the house the food them not, not, not too in there. You don't know. You still provide a little bit. You used to buy 15, 20 pound of rice. Now you can buy 5 pound or 3, 2, 2 pound. So you buy 6 pounds. So you cook 2 pound at a time. You 2 pound in at a time. 2 pound in at a time. You know what I mean? Hold up your head, you out. Don't feel no way. You hear me say, brother? Don't feel no way. Because the whole we got through something now I'm to you. We have to live. The greatest thing, you see, from you have life and you have health and strength, you can live. You can move through. And once you go to mama, you sit down and fret and worry, you put yourself in a more problem because if you fret and worry, you can give yourself a strokes. You catch a strokes right now in a time like this, you could have don't come back from the strokes. See, you could have don't come back from the strokes and guess what you're going to become the problem to somebody. So I say, you don't want to be a problem to nobody. So you just humble me. Nah, tell us you don't have to worry. You know, cause home, if you tell us you don't have to worry. You have to worry. If you have a job, you want to out for a little job. See, you can't have no time for you out of work and sit down in your yard. Because anything you can count. You know, so it can't be done. So you watch your little savings that trickle along a long time. You don't even put 500 Jamaican dollars in your bank account. A long time. You have some silver save and you go into the silver them already and run up and down in the silver them because you didn't need it because you don't know. Lucky things that you don't save them because they take you out of many situation. Somebody ask me why I cash up. So I'm show you my cash up. So I cash up there. God bless you. Somebody said they want to bless me. God bless you. We wake up with nothing and you forget something. We say thank God. See? 
Remember them always that tell us the humble calf suck the most milk. I don't believe in that still. I believe so the young calf will dead for hungry. And let me explain. When you sit down and do, just humble and just make everything a pass, you have to get up and go for year one. That's why I always say every black man is a king, you know. Every woman is a queen. See? Every black man is a king. And every black woman is a queen. But they don't know their kingship and their queenship. And them can make you and tell you say you're a queen, but you have to know say you're a queen. You have to believe say you're a queen. And you never be about to be in a ratina sardine. Black man for just know say them for firm in a earth. You have to hold it and when the pressures of life come, you have to know for hold that. You know, remember when time them used to tell you say we have to learn to suck salt through wooden spoon. So man a suck salt through wooden spoon, but on a suck y'all front through drawers. A that on a do. A the wrong concept on a do. Sucking child through wooden spoon means you have to know for no hard life. Because them always a tell us a young bud no no storm. You know much storm we got you already and not even know say a storm we got you. But this too shall pass. You know what I mean? Don't know, you know, we have to just come on and come talk, you know. You know, don't know the truth, man. Are the truth, you know. More time we talk, and you don't know when time we talk, you know. Look at look at drama coming out and look at you my coming out and some holy pass something but are the facts. When I say Sherry Grant, we have to know if you hold it, boy. Yeah. Zin, alright. All who live a foreign, sometime when you get, I would have think say overseas, in some ways, better. Food wise, you know, than Jamaica and certain other, other, other things. When you, when, you, when, you, when you have papers and a child, you get a whole heap of benefits with you know for your, for your child that means your child not go hungry you know what i mean and you have an opportunity when you have a child like a whole heap of things is set up where you can go in a shelter with all your youth and you know and i like it safe but you don't know you get somewhere for sleep when you're there jamaica you're up on the street you, you like yeah you're picking open up to a whole heap of things seeing because remember we don't get food stamp a month time if you're not work with a company, where a company I tell you, so they give you five thousand dollar food card, where you can go get some food, like you know. But a youth, we do have no education, boy. Yeah. He not have none of that. Forget. See, he not have none of that. Forget, boy. Yeah. Yes, overseas. Listen, me you know. Living in Jamaica, you can beg a tomato, you can beg a onion. Living in foreign. Yeah, your neighbor not even chat. Sometimes when we buck up and go through the door, cause you, you go sub and you blood clean, lock out yourself and you want somebody buzz you up. And you buzz and buzz and buzz and buzz and buzz. You never blood clad go in. You know what I mean? So there's a difference. So in many ways, you have the good and the bad. You have to weigh the pros and the cons. Come in by now. When we did young, everybody used to say morning and everybody used to say, you know, good evening. And people used to stop and hold some conversation and the conversation used to be fluent. Nowadays, our best friends are on the social media. Our neighbors are not our friends anymore. Social media becomes our friends. Chin is my friend, Winsome is my friend, Diamond Child is my friend. You know what I mean? Somebody far, far away in the next country.